the elastic band around your and head. And we are and ready to call the uh, before Secure your own band before the other. Your seat bottom cushion may be used as a flotation device. Pull up and remove the cushion. Upon exiting the aircraft, place your arms around the cushion and hold on to the strap located on the band. is not permitted in the cabin or laboratory. Cabin lights will now be turned off. Green light buttons are located above you. Thank you for your attention. Any ice? Off. Isolation valves. Auto. Engine star switches. Auto. Sorry, continuous. Recall. We check the recall. Checked. Auto brake. RTO. Engine start levers. Idle detent. Flight controls. Checked. Ground equipment. Clear. Before taxi checklist. Okay, we are almost ready to, for takeoff. We just need to call before takeoff checklists. Flaps. Flaps five, green light. Five point five units. Checklist. Only two items there. Okay, we are ready for takeoff. At one left, we just got the clearance. And I call for runway entry procedure and the FO sets up. Check. Clear on the approach. Okay, turns on the strobes. Landing lights. Uh, TCAS and I call take off when Check. I'm ready and off we go set N1 to about 50% and I push the black toga switch and the plane sets Departure thrust. 80 knots. V1. Rotate. Positive right. Gear up. Gear up. Okay, the, I still have manual control of the plane. I follow the flight director. In the HSI display. See the plane reduced the thrust to climb one, uh, set in the FMC. Now we reduce the flaps. Okay, I just call flaps one. And when the flaps are up, we can uh, connect the autopilot. Which the FO can be instructed to do also. We have a clean plane now and uh, FO is set Doing his after takeoff flow, call the VNAV and the LNAV, and in a few seconds, now the plane is flying itself, following the route all the way to Bergen with the right speeds and trust settings. Stand by. FO is doing the after takeoff checklist. Engine blades 
on, tax, auto, landing gear, up and off, flaps, up, no lights, after takeoff checklist, complete. That's it, I hope you enjoyed this little tutorial. I probably forgot something, and I'll watch your comments on my YouTube channel.